Yeah, we lived here for almost 15 years. The Smiths still own it, but they're visitors in their own home. The minute you get out of the car, you can still smell all of that smoke, and it just brings you instantly back to that night. Two years ago, the duplex next door burst into flames. We woke up and it was just the, the, the smoke just started to infiltrate in the house. The homeowner next door did not have insurance, so the Smiths had to file a claim against their own insurance, Universal Property and Casualty. To see it, you know, just so damaged and not have the ability to fix it and, you know, put it back the way it needs to be, it's hard. The Smiths and their public adjuster, Frank Fortson, feel the home needs to be gutted. But the insurance company said the duplex isn't dangerous or unsafe. The smoke is not just on the exterior of the wall, but it's on the interior. Uh, in the wall cavities, they need to pull out that porous material, which is paper, and replace it. And they can't just paint over it. Have you seen similar structures in this condition just painted and cleaned? Uh, I have, yeah. yeah. Safely? No. Fortson says it's not unusual for a customer to argue over damages with their insurer. They're all trying to fight to keep as much money as they can. The Smiths took their financial dispute to court, filing a lawsuit in December. Universal said lawsuits are filed in less than 1% of its claims. According to state records, 255 homeowners planned to sue last year over claim denials, delays, or unsatisfactory settlements. That's almost the same number as Citizens, the state's largest insurer, which has twice as many customers as Universal. Well, and understand that you can pay your premiums faithfully and know that if you have a claim, that doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to get, you know, reimbursed. The longer this dispute lasts, the Smiths say the more they go into debt, paying experts and paying their own bills. It's hard to pay for a mortgage that's on a house that's just sitting here. Universal said it's reviewed this case and feels the amount offered to repair the home is justified under the policy. To see their full statement, go to WPTV.com. I'm Consumer Watchdog Jen Strathman, fighting for you.